So this is where we are spending our Easter long weekend, which is Good Friday up to Easter Sunday. Sorry, Easter Monday, technically. So this is called a Wendy Cottage because it's a dollhouse, but human size. So the proportions are actually like a dollhouse and it's beautiful here. The air is so crisp. And we specifically chose a place where we could bring a lovely lady and it's a heritage garden. Ooh. on view I wanted to show this adorable little life-size dolls cottage so apparently it's called a Wendy cottage and you can tell because the scale is like a doll's house scale rather than a real life scale and it's so cute look look at the fixtures the light fixtures I'm just tall as fuck <laughs> And there's a bathroom. Everything's adorable and tiny. Adorable and tiny kitchen. And then adorable and tiny upstairs, which I'll show you guys later. And then there's Lady. Hi, Lady. She's having a good time having an explore. Oh, what are you doing? Oh, she pooed? Yeah. Good job, lady. Yay! Oh, hi, baby. Hi. Adorable <laughs> little houses. Oh! Oh, lady. Oh, no, lady. You <laughs> got all wet. Oh, shit. That's one thing you didn't bring. It's great for vlogging. It's exactly what I wanted. Hi. Yeah. hi. <laughs> So much to sniff. <laughs> There's a tennis court. This is like heaven for lady. Super cute. <laughs> Over there is a pool covered with moss. We've got Lady on a leash now. Thirsty. 
another beautiful area. It's just so beautiful and lush and green. amazing it looks like it's hewn by you know some ancient civilization it's probably not but I do love the way that it's huh? where are the glasses oh no <laughs> yep I'm gonna rest at this gazebo somebody also left their phone here as well hmm. There's another little doggy. It's a Jack Russell, I think. So pretty and serene. Lady. Hmm. It's actually so beautiful. I think there's a cat in the Oh. It's a little dog in the backpack. Look how nice that looks. The background's like a bit of a Look at me and my double chin. <laughs> mm. No, not our house. It was like outside this cottage. Don't eat it, babes. Just get one side each. I mean, one main each. Yeah, and then share it on three or something. Yeah. Cool. We could. I want to ask her which which entrees are warm. Because I. Not oh. sure. for two people. Ooh, do I want the plowman's platter though? Put onions and cob what's a cob loaf? Uh, it's bread. Mm. Yeah, I'm gonna get the French mushroom risotto. Ooh. That just looks too good. And then we'll get an entree. Yeah. Which okay. entree do you want? Let's do we'll get the Retro porn cocktail, but or yeah, that one. Yeah, Which one are you getting? Royal beef. Okay. Yeah. Mm. Oh, I could get the braised beef cheek. Yeah, that's something I was looking at too. Oh, is it just sassafras? Oh. Okay, I 
can't decide if I want no. the braised beef cheek yeah. or the French mushroom risotto because I feel like I could get risotto anywhere. But also, this looks cute as anything with King Henry. This man knows how to eat. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Honestly, yeah, I'm probably gonna get the beef cheek. Really? Yeah. It's like if we're going to a fancy place. May as well get it. Like I'm not. Why fucking get a Macca's like Macca's? I'm thinking, well, like it's, I'm, I'm getting, getting the face yeah, yeah, I might get the braised beef cheek as well. It, that yeah. just looks so yum. Yeah, I'm going to get that. And I think let's, we'll think about the entrees. Maybe we'll get the main first. Yeah. I don't I know. Mean, what do you want? Honestly, I wouldn't even mind getting like the English cobbler. Yeah. Okay. Just, like a little bit of bread to go with the meat. I do really want the retro pork cocktail for yeah. there, and that's not that much more expensive. Yeah. I'm gonna it's ask fine. her if it's cold though. If it's yeah. cold, no. I'm just it's not a big fan of cold. Oh, true. But honestly, fuck it. Nah, like if you don't like it, then we'll no, go the English pub or because I just like get our own entree. We don't have to finish it, we can take it home and have it for lunch tomorrow or whatever. True, right? true. But I actually am leading, leading more towards, towards the English cobbler because we really love. I love bread. Yeah, I love bread and the English food bread quite well. The German food. Yeah, okay, I've decided I'm gonna get the braised cheek, beef cheese. It just looks so damn good. How can just you just be warned? Everything is 15% more expensive today. Oh really? That's fair. But it is what it is. You know, it's out on holidays. That's cool. We can we can move the car. Yeah. Like honestly, when you think about how much Uber Eats I get, yeah, not that big a deal. It's not that big a deal. Cool. Yeah. Do I want to? Do I want to be like? Yeah, that's a bit warm. So like sad. And it's not even that cold now that I have this. It's been late long, guys. Darling. Oh whoops! I've been recording this whole time. <laughs> that's cute. Excellent. Thank you. We are having breakfast. It's super misty. Too beautiful water colliers here. And a lot of people have said that Lady looks like a baby water collie, and I totally see it actually. Nice and misty out there. I really want to get this one. Right now, take a bag. Oh, look at that big boar. <laughs> the big pig. It's got a hat too. <laughs> yeah. Oh, wow. Hello. Hello. When you say, oh, wow. Yeah. <laughs> awesome. Enjoy. Oh, look at that. That is cool. Wow. Detail on that. If I had the space, I would totally get I really like the 
Japanese bakery, like the red ones. Oh, yeah. Let me show you, this is the doll's staircase that goes up into this adorable little room. Those beautiful window and this mirror here and a cooler. Super pretty. <laughs> It's Easter, they gave us hot cross buns and jam. And this is where we walk through. It's super pretty. It's almost like a wedding archway. And we are heading off. Goodbye, Wendy Cottage. Bye. And we are now leaving. I never got footage of us going in, so this is footage of us going out, and it's super beautiful. Just imagine this, but backwards. <laughs> this would be a really nice little holiday trip for us, like for me to capture. We can both watch Ooh. it real quick. Yeah. We should reverse the footage. Us going in. <laughs> this is a really tight bend. Apparently, there's one bend called the Devil's Elbow that one of the locals was telling us about. But it's very narrow and beautiful, though. Beautiful green, like that's not something that you would see in a in an American movie or something, you know. It's very like Australian. Yeah, it's beautiful. We were kind of wanting to maybe get a bonsai tree, but they're very difficult to maintain. It would basically be like another pet, and I just, you know, I'm, I don't have a great track record with plants. Um, so I kind of like decided against it. And then we thought, oh, well, maybe a fake bonsai, but then that kind of defeats the purpose. But I just really like cute and little things, like little versions of big things. Yeah, that's where we're going. Yay! We've come to another dog-friendly trail. We'll come this way. It's a beautiful, beautiful clearing. And the air up here is so crisp. You just breathe really, really deeply. And, you know, it's kind of like spring water in the same way. It's just super, super fresh and clear. And when I read those kind of um, those novels, say, from Jane Austen, and they talk about how so-and-so relative has gone, you know, to the countryside for the, for the health, for the air. It's like when you come here, you really understand, like, oh, wow, yeah, like, yep. It, it, it is very clean and fresh and I can see <laughs> yes I can see why someone would come to the countryside for their for their, for their health oh babes I was just telling the people that yeah when you read an old novel say like oh so and so had to go to the country for their health you're like yeah, yeah I get it yeah. yeah like the air is so clean yeah Everything's beautiful. It's beautiful. Yeah. It's good for your mental health. And this, you know, like I think industrialization had happened during those times, but yeah. even if you're in the city, it's just such a big difference. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you can see there's a bit of clearing, so you can kind of see into the distance. And here we are. Am I in frame? I can't tell. Uh, I also can't. I think so. <laughs> Damn, <hold on. laughs> 
Lady. Yeah. <laughs> Goodbye.